one issue needs to be called correctly. Could it be convenient to have not there at all? On Gunday Road, Alan. Not there at all. I am uh, pleading to the Creator. First of all, thanking the Creator for this good winter day. I ask the Creator to and I also thank the Creator for the food we eat and the coffee we drink. I ask the Creator to stand us up well and bring a blessing to the Mape people and the Delaware tribe of Indians. Nana, the catch. Amen. Chair Roger Stewart. Here. Crystal Dombrowski, Secretary. Here. Joe Brooks, Treasurer. Here. Kay Anderson, Member. Here. Juanita McGrew, Member. Here. And John Thomas, Member. Here. All present. We have a form. Thank you. Okay, I'd like to welcome everybody that was able to join us today. Our members, especially, for getting out in the braving the weather and the temperatures. Has everybody had a chance to review the agenda? If so, do we have a motion on the table to approve the agenda? Mm -hmm. Second. Second. Roger. Joe second. All those in favor of approving the agenda, please say aye. 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 Any abstentions or opposed? Moving on to the approval of the minutes. Has everybody had a chance to review the minutes? I'll give you a few minutes to take a look. Do I have a motion to approve the minutes? Joe, would you like to? Treasurer's report, I'm going to give first the November financials and then the December's. Uh, November, to start with, we had fair market value as of October the 31st. We had 4,526,332.26. As of November the 30th, we had 4,610,000. And $87.14 for a gain of 
83,754.88. By the committee, reinvestment, they've still got a balance of $15,350.24. That was in November. Cultural preservation, carry forward was $32,300.42. Their budget was fifteen thousand three forty-seven sixty-two. Year-to-date expenditures eight thousand nine eighty eleven. <coughs> Balance thirty-eight thousand six sixty-seven ninety-three. By the way, on reinvestment, they had expenditures of thirty-three dollars and twenty twenty-seven cents. Community services carry forward is eleven thousand two eighty-two. 23, their budget, 38,369.06, year-to-date expenditures, 25,410.88, they still have a balance of $24,240.31. Education, they had carry forward, unrestricted donation, $250. Their budget was $46,042.87. Their year-to-date expenditures, $51,260.01. Makes a negative $1,967.14. Elders Committee had carry forward to $16,214.93. Their budget was $7,673.81. Year-to-date expenditures was 5,109.18, left a balance 18,779.56. Veterans Committee had carry forward of 8,826.04. Their budget was 76.73.81. Year-to-date expenditures 3,496.28. Leaves a better uh, balance of thirteen thousand and three dollars and fifty-seven cents. Tribal operations, their budget is twenty-three thousand. Year-to-date expenditures, twenty-three thousand twenty-one dollars and forty-five cents. That is the October financials. Okay. December's financials. As of November the 30th, it was worth uh, $4,610,087.14. As of December the 31st, it was worth $4,689,187.14. For a gain of 70, 79102 and 33 cents <coughs> by the committees. Reinvestment had a budget of 15347 Year-to-date expenditures, $33.27. Leaves a balance of 15350 Cultural preservation carry forward was $32,300.42, budget $15,347.62, year-to-date expenditures $10,353.99, leaves a balance of $37,294.05. Community services carry forward was $11,282.23. Budget, 38369.06. Year-to-date expenditures, 26377 and 50 cents. Balance, 23273.79. Education, at a carry forward of $250. 
budget was $46,042.87. Year-to-date expenditures, $51,820.01 for a negative balance of $2,527.14. Excuse me. Elders Committee at carry forward of sixteen thousand two fourteen ninety three. Their budget was seven thousand six seventy three eighty one. Their expenditures year to date six thousand and forty seven dollars and seven cents leaves a balance of seventeen thousand eight forty one sixty seven. Veterans Committee. <coughs> And carry it forward eight thousand eight twenty six oh four budget was seven thousand six seventy three eighty one year to date expenditures four thousand six thirty nine sixty one leaves a balance eleven thousand eight sixty twenty four <coughs> tribal operations was twenty three carry forward was nothing Budget was $23,021.45. Year-to-date expenditures, the same, $23,021.45. <clears throat> balance, zero. Uh, your education balance, if you read, it's highlighted in yellow. The balance includes a $3,000 donation from community services. I would like to recommend at this time even though the committee can really approve it, but I'm going to recommend that the trust board go ahead and approve it so we can have a zero balance on the education. I'm going to education for the first of the year. Okay. I'm going to make a motion that, co that the community services make another donation in the amount of $2,527.14 to the Education Committee. Okay. That'll put them at a zero balance at the end of December till we adopt the new budget. Okay. Do I have a second for that motion? I second. Any discussion? May I ask a question? Yes. Uh, on the community service money, Joe? Yes. Uh, let's see, I think you said there was Community services. They're balanced right Okay, now. they got 23,000. 23, 273, 79. Okay. Uh, uh, bring me up to, uh, do, do they usually use that much money through the year? I mean, like people asking for that, like little help for their, whatever their needs are? No. Okay, so so we wouldn't be maybe, no. somebody else needs some services from community services and we, we do you know. The money's still there. Okay. That's what I would want to make sure that we did uh, keep an in. Yeah, we wouldn't be taking anything from community services that somebody would potentially need for funding. I think just about everybody that's on that committee is here from community services. Uh, who holds? Well, this is the end of the end that's of the year. That's fine. That's fine. Just, yeah. just that's sure. fine. Just, I'm all for it. That's fine. I was just curious about I, mean, I know it's a committee's responsibility to make that recommendation, but I've already talked to all of them about it, and they was all for it, so I'm, I'm bringing it to the trust board to, to pass it. Well, I'm in favor of that, just to bring a, a zero balance as we move Yeah, I'd make a zero year. balance till we set the new budget. Right. Yeah. <coughs> Is there any further discussion on this? All those in favor of the motion on the table, please say aye. 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 Did we have a motion to approve the financials? That was just to make the motion that you just made about the two thousand. Oh, well, that's yeah, for the yeah, yeah, for the we, had, but we haven't had a motion on no, no, the the community it, service. So okay. 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 Bonita had seconded that yeah. motion. Okay. Got you. My vote for yes. <coughs> yeah, uh, it was unanimous. There was no abstentions or opposition. Yeah. So I'll let accounting know. Okay. So, did you have any further financial reports? Well, <coughs> not come under new business. 
that's all in the finances for November and December. Okay, that's awesome. So November to or the end of November, there was a gain of eighty three thousand seven hundred fifty four eighty eight, and then the end of December, there was another gain of seventy nine thousand one hundred two dollars and thirty three cents. That is correct. Yes. Good job. Fantastic. Yes, Chief. I uh, would simply like to congratulate the trust board because I think that in December money is the highest the trust has ever been to. Yeah. I'll assure you it is. Fantastic news. I think we're going to report on that um, other new business. Is that correct, Jim? Yeah. Some really good news to share today. And one issue for that, Chief. Appreciate it. Thank you, Chief. The stock market is the stock market has been good right now, but there's some danger. I just I don't know if you guys keep up on it. Oh, yeah. It's been, been good all year except one month. month. Yeah. One month we had one. No, last uh, yesterday during the start of the impeachment, the uh, stock dropped 400. And sixty some points, but uh, it 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 bottomed out with it. We lost one hundred fifty seven. <coughs> but uh, uh, so we, we, I'm glad we're happy. But you know, we just dodged a bullet in the war. Uh, that's not well, over. We have well nothing. But that's all. It affects our money. Yeah. I'm, I'm saying it's this. Just this affects our money because if we do have a problem like that. The stock market's going to fall or whatever, you know. But just to be, just so that we can be on our toes about stuff and doing all as well. Yeah, don't forget the these gains are on paper. Right. They're not really a gain unless we cashed in the whole trust. Yes. Stock. Right. Because the last time we were pretty, uh, Joe, remember the last time we did good like that? Well, we raised uh, we raised a uh, percentage on some of our education and also on our burial. But then the fall, of, uh, and then the stock market dropped dropped out of us, and we lost all everything that we gave for that year, so we couldn't fund our our program. Still, well, got, still came out all but right. We did. We gained it all back. We did. Yeah, so we gained it all back. Yeah, so right. it all back but that's just a fluctuation. It goes up and down. Okay, so uh, do we have a motion to approve November December two thousand nineteen financials? Mm -hmm. we have a second. Second. Is there any further discussion regarding the financial reports for November and December? Okay. All those in favor, please say aye of approving the financials for November and December 2019. Aye. Aye. Any abstention or opposition? Okay. The reports are approved. Moving on to our committee reports. What do we have? We have tribal operations here. Community service is the first one there. We have no, no report, no meeting. We will have our meeting next Monday because we have no budget to work with. What time is that meeting on Monday, Joe? It's at uh, 1 30, I think. 1 30? Yes. 1 30 on Monday. Community services and education. 27. 27. Yeah. 27. That is correct. Okay. Um, we have a cultural preservation report. Would somebody like to report on that? Um, Von Eden, would you like to report on uh, about the the How's the Mama Center Mama classes coming? Mm -hmm. Well, it's over. Okay. Did everybody complete their projects? No. Or did anybody did? I think uh, oh. I think uh, Nancy's boy did. Yeah. But I don't think anybody else did, did they? Well, Lynette. Oh, well, yeah. Yeah. But they knew what this did. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, she just read to oh. let people come to her house to finish yeah. it, correct? Yes, she told us that we Yes. yes. Yeah, we were. I was wondering if it was going to be extended or if there's going to be additional classes. Well, she said that anybody can come to her house. 
we, Camden and Caden come up to our house, and we brought a big pot of soup over there because I didn't know who else was coming. Oh, good. And uh, we stayed there until about 8 o'clock. Saturday? Uh, no. Saturday had the, uh, oh, yes. the planes, yes. so we went Monday mm -hmm. and stayed over there until 8 o'clock. The girls starting to do their bee work, mm -hmm. and then we'll go back over there when they get their bee work done. Mm -hmm. But she said that anybody can come over there and work on their moxes. She says it's easier doing it a few at a time than the big class that we had. Yeah. We had such a big class. Yeah, 37 people. Oh, yeah. wow. And everybody was in all different stages of their moccasins. In fact, at the last at the last class, <coughs> we're just now cutting out their their moccasins. Oh goodness! <laughs> I ripped mine all out and done it again because mine was so ugly. I looked like I was a shelf, oh. elf on a shelf. Mine. That's what Kate had to do. She had to rip hers all out. She had oh. sold it. She had sold it so close together she couldn't mm -hmm. even spread it apart or anything to pound it down. So she had to rip it all out and resew it and everything. Charlie, you got a date for the stomp things? Yeah. Um, the, the glass went well when we had to be done and everything. Yeah. It just, we yeah. none of us got, I, I could have got more done than I did because I, my cousin was there and I sat and messed with her. I, I could have done more, but I was trying to work with both my granddaughter yeah. and helping each one of them, but I couldn't work on mine. So. You'd think my cousin would get together and have to visit, but you had to make sure. <laughs> But it was a good class. Yeah, everybody, everybody okay. enjoyed yeah. doing that. So it was a good class. Hey, Marcus, you class. Wow. That's when Margaret Bird came. Mm -hmm. is she, is, are you finished mm -hmm. with the class now? Or the classes ended, but we were going to have to help everybody in the class. That's why I thought super. Mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Stomp bands, March right. the 14th, chili dinner at 6 and dance at 7. Okay. And what is the location? Dewey Fair Building. Dewey Fair Ground. Okay. 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 South End. Dance at 7. We're at the end of the day, it's last week. Going for that deal. South End. Yeah, that has to have a bigger room. Yeah. Well, I need to have something else there, do you know? <clears throat> And Joe and Kay is going to cook for this. And anybody else that wants to help. We'll have dog chili again. Dog chili. Some delicious. Medicine, ground chuck. Free chili and bean dinner. Okay. Session stand rice. And Kay, are you making the fry bread? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That goes without do saying. you think that you're going to be well enough to do all that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll help. If she ain't, I'll just shoot her. Bring your volunteers. We'll also food. have cornbread. Feel free okay. to donate cakewalk or auction. Oh, okay. cakewalk or auction? Yeah. Vendors are welcome. Set up time is 4 p.m. Bring your lawn chairs. Bring your cans. Start. Yeah. So let everybody know about it. Absolutely. Is that on our website yet? Do you know if that's been posted on there? I don't think it's, it on, it's on the website and it's on the it? Facebook page. I thought I seen it on Fantastic. Okay. okay. No worries. So everybody it's share on their Facebook in the page. Den when we get it out. Great. Yes, Chief. Uh, I, I just wanted to make a comment about the stomp bands. <coughs> the, the tribal council is planning on doing some strategic planning for the next three to 
five years. Mm -hmm. And uh, we want tribal members' input in, into that. So I have took the opportunity after asking several of the cultural committee members mm -hmm. to call a town hall meeting at 2 o'clock at the Washington County Fairgrounds in, in hopes that it just caused more people to come to the stomp dance and okay. it also caused more people to come to the yeah. town more, hall. More involvement, absolutely. That's good. I think that's a great idea. And we got that in the Delaware Indian News too that's shortly coming out. Okay. So uh, I'd, mm -hmm. I'd like for all of the trust board members and everybody you can get to come to vote. Absolutely. Thank you. Yeah. That, we've, got him, we've got him down as the first leader to stop that. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and you say, I'll, I'll, I'll have to buy me another cat on there. I don't want to be excited. <laughs> Now that's March 22nd again? Yes, March 14th. 14th. March 14th. March 14th. March 14th. I'm sorry, I said, mm -hmm. yeah. March the Kate, is there a, uh, is there, to, to, in order to kind of like entice people to come to this particular uh, mm -hmm. a meeting for this a strategic vision, is there, is there anything that, uh, uh, that we can help with maybe to entice people to come uh, I don't know why. I'm just. I know we're going to have a chili dinner that evening. Like a door prize or something. Door prizes or or yeah, something like that. Or maybe uh, you know we can give some stuff. And maybe we can vote some money here for that particular project to encourage people to come. Maybe to get a little gas card or maybe this or that or whatever. Mm -hmm. Some kind of a drawings or some kind of a little. Thing like cats to uh, the entice yeah, people to come, idea. and that could be advertised. You know that things like that will be happening. Mm -hmm. Maybe refreshments or just small stuff. You know, yeah. it's nothing, nothing, no. Well, that's a good deal idea. Breaker. We can all we can all kind of think about that between now and next month's meeting, and then bring some type of a proposal and an amount uh, to be approved at next month's meeting in February. Yeah. Okay. Uh, but and whatever yeah, ideals, you know, whatever ideals that people may have pertaining to that, that's why I think that the trust board could participate in, in, in encouraging this meeting here with the town council. Absolutely. And the people that hey, we're all one. Yeah. Yeah. It's for yeah. all. Yeah. Uh, for all. Of us. So exactly. That's why I wanted to. Uh, so they just the suggested dance? that I don't. Uh, we can talk about it next month. That what you said. Well, yeah, to bring an okay. amount. Okay, there we, may be a, we make a motion or resolution like then sure. for a certain amount. Mm -hmm. We can we do, can that, do next, that next month. month. Okay. That'll give us a little time, time to think about it. Exactly. Put together a plan. Yep, yeah, exactly. sure. Now, what time is that town hall starting? We have chili dinner at 6 p.m. It's at 2 o'clock. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's four hours. That's a great idea. I really. 12 to 10. I'm really supportive of that. Or just to two to whatever, however long it lasts. Well, okay. I, I, I think the dinner is going to start. Yeah, the dinner starts at six. So, okay, so a couple hours so for that meeting. Yeah, at least a couple hours. You get a bunch of Delaware together, you want to give them all a little bit, at least a couple of hours. <laughs> To get there. Get their input. Mm -hmm. I'm sure well, not just to get there, but yeah. <laughs> For them to get their points across. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's all the entertainment you need. <laughs> okay. Um, thank you for that, Bonita and Joe. That's fantastic news. Um, Kay, would you like to give us a report on the cultural preservation? I'm sorry. Um, Elders Committee. I haven't turned the page yet. <laughs> Okay, the elders say um, we had all planned on going to the casino, but it snowed that day, the weather was bad, so mm -hmm. not everybody was wanting to go. So we took the edge instead of taking the van full of the people. But there were a lot of people that did go meet us down there. So they got their free play and their um, food voucher. And the husk, is that what she's doing? That's when we went to the husk. 
Mm -hmm. There was a lot of people that did. Well, drive we drove their cars. Yeah, they drove their own. So they didn't have to take the bus. I mean, the van, because I didn't want to drive. <laughs> so, everybody had a nice time. Yeah, not, and everybody. We got, the van left, the van left at a certain time. And some of them stayed, some of them went to the <coughs> casino on the hill. Mm -hmm. We went on with the Browns and came back home and planning our next trip to the casino up on the hill on a Thursday after we play bingo. Then that way we can eat lunch or eat the Dinner. Thursday night supper there and then come back. We'll have it planned out perfectly. 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 We'll have it planned out Vice Chief Charles Randall stated his displeasure with what he termed vacations That's exactly. that the Elders Committee has approved and taken. I would like to voice my personal opinion that the elders have worked hard all their lives to be taken care of by our tribe. And if one person doesn't understand that, I believe he's in the wrong. That's yes. my personal Many opinion. Times. I believe that this tribe should take care of our elders and our tribe should take care of our children. Right. I agree. Absolutely. I agree. And the elders should have the right to go wherever they want to go. Absolutely. Absolutely. Whenever and wherever. Just because I shut up. I mean, no, you go right ahead. No. To, to, to spend the night at one place. I mean, we, so we wouldn't have to hurry and do this and hurry up and do that. To spend the night at one place. Mm -hmm. I think it's good so that it keeps it like Ed Bonnie likes to go. Okay. Well, and it's a great social outing. It's an opportunity for everybody to get together, to visit, to get out of their normal routine, their normal four, normal four walls that they would be at. It gives them more than an hour a day. Exactly. Exactly. It's physically healthy and mentally healthy. Yeah. Yeah. It's good for you. Absolutely. <coughs> it is. I don't promote sheddings. No. Not at all. No. And, and we all have a good time when we do that. We oh, all yeah. laugh and carry on in the You don't um, have to, you don't have trip. exactly, yeah. 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 You don't have to play at the casino or something. Yeah. You can yeah, go swimming. They have other things. They have their shop. Can you see me swimming? <laughs> I'm not, I'm not going to say anything because I'm on tribal council also, and I think everybody knows my opinions in here. Yeah, well, I think um, this trust board collectively shares the same opinion regarding the statements that are made in these yes. pits. So. Okay, thank you for reporting on that, and everyone. Mm -hmm. Chief Brooks, would you like to provide any... Um, Anything on the tribal operations report? Yeah, nothing other than um, the tribe appreciates the percentage of the budget that gets turned over to the tribe. Now, I understand that y'all are going to set a budget today, and uh, I, I can only say that tribe doesn't necessarily need the money this month, but whenever it's convenient, yeah. we'll take it. <laughs> sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Chief. Oh, I forgot something. Oh, go ahead, Jim. Uh, also, we're going back to honor our oldest elder, because we have been getting away from that. Uh -huh. And honor that, so then trying to go look into that, trying to find out our oldest Delaware elder to honor them with blanket because we're supposed to do it every every three months and we haven't been doing that. Okay, and have you all identified, I know there was discussion a month or so ago in trying to identify who that person is well, and where they're located? Yeah, we're you still, still in the process. I was, I was off a lot last week. I had a, have a heart cath done, so I haven't gone oh, up to the, to the um, Enrollment to mm -hmm. find out any more about the oldest elder. 
I do have a list. I'm not with me uh, of some of the oldest ones. Okay. But um, we have to find out if they're alive and what their addresses are. Uh, Absolutely. Yeah. So still working on that. Okay. Well, keep us keep us um, in the loop okay. on on the developments of that. Are there any um, further reports in the feedback? If not, um, we have a motion to approve all of the reports, committee reports. I'll make a motion to all right. approve all the committee reports. Thank you, Jeff. Do I have a second? I'll second. second. Oh, second. <laughs> we got all or nothing. <laughs> we got a, a second or third. Then, of <laughs> Okay, no further discussion. Do I have um, all those in favor of approving the committee reports? Please say aye. 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 Any abstention or opposition? Okay, yeah, all the reports are approved. Moving on to unfinished business. Is there any further unfinished business to discuss today? Yes, Joe. Yes, on the all the committees of the trust board and the tribal council. The price we are supposed to pay in the gift shop is a cost plus freight, whatever the freight is, plus 10%. So they're supposed to add the cost of that item plus the freight, and then that times 1.1. One. Uh, it got all messed up. They're going to charge us the regular retailer <coughs> plus 10%. I said, no. That ain't going to work. It's cost plus freight times 1.1. One. Okay. So and if any of the committees want to buy anything through the gift shop, challenge them. Because she got the directive from <laughs> higher up that that's what she'd be charging the committees. That's not right. So is this what as the our tribal council voted on is cost plus freight times 1.1, 1 .1, which is 10 percent. So this is our committees collectively. This is Any not individuals. This is not, not individuals. Individuals, individuals, individuals pay the okay. regular retail price. And I'll tell you why. We've got a cheaper retail price than anybody probably in the state. Uh, it's a cost plus 1.5. Cost plus freight times 1.5. Okay. Well, we might keep that in mind as we move forward in the discussion of uh, what we're going to provide for the um, yeah, for this year, for door the, prizes door for prizes the, that we get yeah, right. We'll want to keep I'm that in mind. I'm sure. right from the gift shop. So that's kind of yeah, that's the business. business. I just want to let everybody know that we're supposed Absolutely. to be paid. Yeah, so we're going to know how they give it. And sure. give it to step two, our people. Yeah, exactly. Win, win, win. That's what we're going to do. Well, that's exactly. Appreciate you bringing that to uh, bringing that up, Joe. I, I wonder about the gift shop why they don't get more stuff in there. I mean, like they used to have shirts that said <coughs> different little silly things on them uh -huh. that we bought, and the one I can't remember. There's been two or three of them that I've had, but it was a long time ago. Mm -hmm. And I think they could do well if they had order some of that kind of stuff or seek out new vendors, maybe. Yeah, exactly. Because that stuff that's in there, I've seen over and over and over and over every time I go in there. Who wrote that? Is that Anita? Is that Anita that oversees that? I think they should get some new stuff in there that would interest people to come in and buy. Well, there's plenty of interesting stuff in there. Well, there like is, that. but they need new stuff also. <coughs> okay. They need right. some new hats and some new shirts and some new, just, you know, Stuff like that, I, I would go down there and buy a lot of stuff yeah. and, and get some small sizes where you can buy for your little kids. Yeah, very true. Okay, is there any further unfin unfinished business? How long do we have? <laughs> Not enough. <laughs> well, <laughs> okay, moving on to new business. Yes, Joe. Under new business, you all have a copy of the financials for the whole year laid there in front of you. Yes. If you'll look after all expenses, this trust board made $597,898.81 for the year. 
I would like to recommend increasing the budget to $240,000, which would more than give education enough where they won't, won't be going in the hole anymore. And we earned uh, 600000 but I think we are to continue to let the trust document increase, which we did a pretty good job this year. Yeah, fantastic stock, job. Stock market, good drop. Mm -hmm. I agree with what John said, but, but we've got enough money to where you increase the budget to $240,000. And I'll make that in the form of a motion. Yeah, I'll second. Roger. Is there uh, any discussion? Where's the plan? What we're going to do with the $90,000 increase <clears throat> from what we uh, used from 150 to 3 to 240. To 240? Yes. The, the plan, plan is a $90,000. The plan is increase. the percentages that our tribal members approved <clears throat> in the trust board. And the trust document. Yeah. So that boiled down to his reinvestment get twenty four thousand, uh, cultural preservation twenty four thousand, community services six to th sixty thousand, educational have seventy two thousand, elders committee twelve thousand, veterans committee twelve thousand, and the last one? oh education thirty six thousand. No, that's no, not right. Not Education was seventy-two thousand. Yeah. That was tribal or tribal, tribal operations. operations. Yeah. Last one, tribal operations. And how much is the breakdown on that? Thirty. It's thirty-six thousand. Thirty-six. That comes out to exactly two hundred forty thousand. Okay. So I'll make that in form of motion. We made that in the form of the motion. Roger has seconded the motion. We're in discussion. Uh, I want to make sure that everybody um, knows that this increase, um, the largest committee, the committee with the largest increase is our education committee and community services committee. Um, you know, last year we had a, a, an extreme deficit that we were unable to fund a number of our scholarships and we had to cut a number of our programs that we normally have. And with this increase, we're hoping to be able to offset that and not only meet the needs that we were not able to meet last year in 2019, but be able to meet even more in 2020. So I think it's absolutely fantastic with this increase, we'll be able to serve more of our tribal members. Mm -hmm. uh, we, yes, John? We really gotta be careful here. I, I, I'm all favored for giving our, giving our committees all that we can give them, don't get me wrong. I'm all in favor of that, but we've got to be careful here. Uh, uh, as I mentioned, you know, we, the last time we raised, it was just a small raise, and, and we went broke. The next year we went broke, we couldn't fund our programs. So we had to take it out of money that we already had, because of uh, 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 3.8 to, I think we might have had four. So we took that money out of there uh, in order to fund our programs. Are you now, referring to last? Yeah, yeah, we uh, we went we went through this already, and, and that uh, we we're possibly <clears throat> if we lose money in the stock market, we could possibly be around at three point eight. Joe, what does that leave our uh, what would that leave our balance? Um, what would that leave our balance? Yes, that is is. This is just November, December. This is the uh, uh, this stock market game. Is a gain on and, paper. Uh, it's a gain on paper. And and as I said, I, I asked the bankers before when they came in here three years ago. If what happened? Okay, he's going to tell you. Yeah. Go ahead, John. You're. You've got I, I uh, the, the bankers Arbus came in here three years. This is before most of you was here. I don't think you guys was here yet. And this was right after the election. And so there was serious talk on a national political level there about going to war. Because uh, we were breaking out of <coughs> the agreement with Iran. They were bad talking Iran. But we got over that, and now here we are again. 
we're on this verge of war. We are at war, actually. And been there for a long time. We're not shooting. Pardon me? I said, and been there a long time. Yeah. And uh, <clears throat> Iran, I, I've been there. I've been in the Middle East. I, I've been to Iran. I know those people. I mean, I won't say I know them, know them. But they ain't going to forget. They haven't forget that they killed your general. Are we going to uh, forget if, they, if somebody killed Chet here? Or, or Joe? Oh, my God. <laughs> you know, are we going to forget that? No, that's the way those people are. They're not going to forget that. So consequently, they are waiting to attack us. I mean, just, just like am, I, am I losing you? Am I losing? Did I lose you guys? Well, just like we have not forgot about 9/11. We haven't forgot about all the terrorist acts that have so happened. That's... This is something that goes on and on and on. And you know, you talk about the wars, but there's also uh, China. There's other. Sure. There's other countries that, that are involved too. on an international level. Right. There's so many variables that go into the stock market that affect right. us it's down trade, here. Trade agreements. Right, uh, exactly. And so That's I why feel we've got to be careful. We do have to be careful. But I feel like, you know, we, we set a budget every year and we go with what we have in front of us. Next year it may not be so good. But right now, let's let's increase our scholarships. Let's um, pay for student classes. Let's let's help so our, let's help classes. our children as much as we can while yes. we can. Next year no. Who knows? We don't have a crystal ball. So that's trust board. Yes, Joe. Yeah, Michelle, the question was asked how much would that yes. leave after our budget? Yes. It would leave four million four hundred and forty nine thousand one hundred and eighty nine dollars and forty cents to the penny. Okay. That's pulling out two hundred and forty thousand for a budget. But even if we set two hundred and forty thousand for a budget, you got the elders committee, you've got the veterans committee, and some of them committees are not going to spend all that, so it's still going to be their earning interest. Yeah. See what I'm saying here? But that will give us plenty for the education committee not to be having to ask for donations to get them to a zero balance. Right. Exactly. But we are uh, Monday, that's coming Monday, I am going to recommend that we reinstate a lot of them services. We was given every house and high school graduate, we was given $100 just to, just to get them to finish high school. Uh, we was doing, uh, what else was we doing? We was doing the driver's uh, ed classes. Huh? The driver's ed classes. Driver's ed classes. Mm -hmm. uh, we was talking about increasing maybe the trade schools, because some of them, like you can get an LPN degree at Tri-County Tech, yeah. that ought to be considered a full-time scholarship. Yeah, I agree, I agree, yeah. Just like my daughter, she got an RA degree in two years and three months. I'm not bragging, but that and was, cons that that was considered a full-time scholarship. But yeah. some of the other ones, like LPN, that should be considered full-time. Because it takes a I lot agree. of work to even get an LPN license. So, yeah, we're going to, I'm going to make a motion at the committee level that we reinstate the budget and services. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm supportive kind of, of all of our educational levels. And, and, and uh, uh, let's remember also that uh, we, we don't want to have so much of money. We're not a rich tribe. And uh, 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 one, uh, we all love education. I don't think anybody in here is it. Is it? We all love our kids and their grandpa. Or grandma. <laughs> or grandma or grandpa. <laughs> so so what I'm saying is let's live within our budgets. If the education committee's got so much money, you uh, reach out, that's it. You, uh, uh, this is the second time. It, but I'm glad that we raised everybody's instead of just one. That's we what have I was to, after. People sure. voted on. Right. Mm -hmm. People voted on the percentages. We have no choice but to raise everybody. Right. Right. For that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Motion's been made and seconded. Uh, discussion. 
Any further? $240,000. How did we come up with that figure? Talking to Alan Barnes about our education. I mean, uh, I did a little talking to people. I mean, I'm, looking, I'm looking at what we made for the year. Five hundred ninety-seven thousand. Why not? No, that's fine. You're that's fine. We're here. It's that's not fine. even a third of what we did this year. Right. And I think we are to be able to furnish some good services to our tribal members. Absolutely. Can, uh, uh, can we do more? We could. Should we, we don't do, need. Should we do a little bit less? Or what can we do? Well, we looked at two thirty. Me and Alan what else can we do with our money? I mean, how else can we? Then that would be more in mean, line, reinstate, and all these other things that we think that allowed. Right. That's why I'm recommending 240. And I, I trust Joe. Uh, he, he is a businessman and he's handled budgets before, and I don't believe that he would uh, put us in any uh, danger of, of overspending what we have. And I believe that's why mm -hmm. he's in. The position that he's in is because he understands and he knows and he, he's experienced it, at making budgets and setting. You know setting. what? I want to modify my motion. I want to modify it to say that we can reconsider every three months just like we did last year. This increase? Why? The increase or we might decide we need to decrease. We can't be doing that. Depending on I'm the saying the trust, we don't I mean, review we, it. Yeah, we can review it, but we, we don't want to say, well, we're going to take it away or raise it up or whatever, like have put our committees or put ourselves in a position where we don't know where our budget's going to be. Leave, leave it there for the year. And uh, We can uh, still review it every three months. Uh -huh. You can review it. Yes, review it every three months. And then it goes home trust we change. Decide we need okay. to decrease we make it. We change it every time we... Well, and John, that might be beneficial, and according to what you had, um, you know, the, the concerns that you yeah. had brought up regarding the fluctuations of the stock market. Right. So it could be beneficial for us to review it. That's what quarterly. we did last year. We yeah. reviewed every what other months. Let me ask you something, Joe. $240,000 a year. Uh, how, how, uh, how much are we going to need to make on our money next year? Uh, how, uh, what are we making on our money? Because I know it's fluctuating up and down. It fluctuates. The average, I know fluctuates the average month is, to month. The average may be, I don't know what the average is to the time here. I know they got it in their chart at the bank. Maybe we can get the bank here. And, and, uh, and then we're going to zero out where we're not making any money. Our, our, our investment is just stagnant. That's why I'm saying only make it two hundred forty thousand. We earned six hundred thousand, but that we are, just, little, we that are just one little month. That's, that's a as on paper, months. we should let it grow. Yeah, yeah. We should let it grow also. <clears throat> okay, so Joe, you modified your motion. Is there a second to I just to review it every three months? Right. Just to review. Okay, Bonnie, to second. Okay, all those in favor of motion on the table, please say aye. 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 Any abstentions? Opposition? Uh, <laughs> I, I don't. Uh, I just wish we had some more discussion. I wish we could have had maybe a meeting ahead of time where we all could have sat down and talked about it. How maybe we could do less, more. We could figure out a little bit more about our figures. Maybe uh, from the bank people, how this is going to be fluctuating overall. How is it going to affect our uh, portfolio? Uh, in, in, in gaining, mm -hmm. or if there's a, you know, maybe one year we might have a loss, mm -hmm. but that's just what I'm saying. I mean, I, I'm John, not we've interested. All, we've all made our, we've all voted. We're awaiting your vote. Okay. Are you for, against, or are you abstaining? I, I'm, I'm for it. Okay. Yeah. That's a yay. That's a yay. Okay. Reluctant yes, okay. but that's a yes. <laughs> all right. The motion passes unanimously. <laughs> One issue, and I'm sure each one of our students that will be applying this year say a big one issue to this board as well and the committees. And all the elders thinking yeah. education. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, I think that we need more things for the elders too. 
I mean, like when we go get blessings, we have to pay for mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you get things, I don't like, you know, I, I get the bifocal because I can't see all those other ones. Yeah. And all will pay for standard lenses. Yes. Yes. And you, yeah. yes. you can't have them, what, tinted weight, uh, what do you call it? It can't be, yeah, I mean, when the elders needs help, too. They won't pay for the no line trifocal yeah. or bifocal. Because I can admit my, my grandmother wouldn't do They'll pay for regular bifocal. Well, that might be something to bring up at the next um, community services committee meeting. Yes. yes. To modify what services that they're going to be able to. That's move. Monday. That That's what be. we're going to do. We're going to review all the services. And we're going to reinstate just about every one of them that we took mm -hmm. away. Yeah, discuss guidelines and yeah. modifications. Yeah. I mean, if you live on a fixed income, some of those charges add up and you just well, can't. Absolutely. And I'd also like to say that um, I know Church Nation offers a lot of coffee. Don't we do have that uh, mm -hmm. uh, broken right, down right. by that's what percentage that's oh, going to increase each budget? By the committee? But still, yeah. it, what is it, about eight percent? I read it too long ago. That's what I do with it. I gotta find it again, John. Uh, by that committee you've talked about? Yeah, is it is it gonna Yeah, it's gonna Crystal increase. Crystal notated that in the minutes that we'll have for this meeting is the breakdown of, of the increments, the percentages for oh. each committee. Yeah, yeah I, think I was wondering what this Crystal made sure to include that in the minutes. I, like, I, I gave did I not I gave them, didn't I, Crystal? Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Five committees. Yes. 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 Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And I, I have it written down for right. my notes. Yeah, I just didn't write it down fast enough. <laughs> 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 okay, um, is there does anybody else have any further new business? Okay, there's something that I wanted to uh, bring up. Uh, for discussion at this uh, board level at our uh, reinvestment committee meeting prior to last month's meeting we had discussed the creation or just even the exploration <clears throat> of developing an endowment um, for our future funds uh, we, we discussed it we really haven't had with the holidays and all the other various activities going on, um, none of us that were in that discussion has had a chance to really dive in or bring anything, uh, any information back for discussion. So I'd like to ask on this, con this trust board, who would be interested and willing, interesting and being involved, yes, but willing to actually do the work in exploring, researching, things like that, bringing back information for discussion as we move forward in potentially putting this together. I'd also like to ask all of the committee mem the committees if there are individuals on each committee that would be involved and interested in being involved. As um, treasurer, I'm interested. Absolutely, yes. And, um, and it goes without saying, yes, I, I absolutely um, will be involved. And, and looking through figuring out what we can, what we can't do per our trust documents. Um, I'm just trying to find a way to grow our money smarter and uh, providing more scholarship opportunities, um, funding opportunities. It's, other, it's really my goal. Yes, other, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm well, any to, of you that are uh, interested, Joe, I know that you've already vocalized that and we had a, a brief discussion about this uh, earlier. Crystal, I know you're interested as well. Um, Red Day Johnson, she um, is interested in, uh, and she was active in the, the discussion that we had last month. Uh, any other tribal council member, or, or for that matter, um, tribal member that's interested, please uh, shoot me an email or text me, Facebook me something, and let me know that you're interested, because I would like to establish a working group um, on this project and be able to start bringing back uh, reports as soon as maybe even next month's meeting. Yes. Um, you need to look at our trust document. In there, it says clearly that all of our money should be in interest bearing account. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so we're kind of boxed in there in a way. Well, this is where it's going to take and what, diving, diving in and actually actually interpreting that document as far as, far as 
what the wording breaks down to, what we can and can't do. That's going to be the first steps. And then what we do have, when we do have a clear understanding of what we can or can't do, then either we move forward or we don't. Um, That's why this is a working group would, to have multiple people working I'm, on I'm this. I'm all for you. Don't get me wrong. I'm all for you. And I'm all for what you're saying. Well, it's, the, it's the project. Yeah, and, not and, but what I see, it, it, I've been on this board only three years. Only been around here for three years. I, I, I'm kind of like an outsider looking in, if you want to look at it that way, because uh, 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 it's 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 got to change where what you want to do, your what he wants to do, the strategic planning, uh, what we can do with our committee's house, yeah. we can work with our monies. It, it, we should get up and talk talking about well, millions. Well, and this and this can be a topic to it, be it, discussed it, at our. We've got uh, to change this meeting. truck document. We've got to have. A hundred people quorum. We should put everything that we have in putting that together, and so that uh, and make it a family event. But uh, in order to get a hundred people here to change this document, I mean we can do it uh, uh, the hard way, initiative petition, or we can try to get uh, uh, people here for general council meeting. Well, this purpose um, is to bring up for discussion and gauge interest and start developing this. We're not even, um, we haven't even created the working group yet to even discuss changing, making any changes to our trust document. So we can't put the cart before the horse. We have to crawl first and then start figuring this out. So the more people that are interested and involved, the more uh, feedback we can, we can gauge. So that was, that was all I have to say on that topic, so please feel free to contact me. Joe? Yes, Joe. Yeah, one other item. I'd like to ask all the trust board members to talk to you council members. I know of two council members sitting right here at this board. It was a joint lawsuit on that money that the tribes yanked. And it was a joint lawsuit, has been all along, and talk to your council members. This this trust board should be entitled to invest fifty percent of the money. Uh, so talk, talk to you. Yeah, are you talking members. about this uh, money that was released? Yeah. Yes. It clearly exactly. states it, it clearly states in the trust board document, it clearly states in the uh, tribal council document the money goes all of it goes to the trust board. Well, you want to follow the rules. But it was a joint lawsuit. It was a joint right. lawsuit, the, but the tribal is, council and the trust board. Right. I believe Chief has something to share with us. Yes, Chief. Okay. Well, all I'm asking is just talk to your council members. To what Dr. Mm -hmm. said, I don't agree that it all goes to the trust board for this reason. It came out of trust mm -hmm. to go to end individual and the tribe back 10 and 12 years ago the tribe and the trust mm -hmm. jointly were, were even introducing the bill in Congress to get that money paid it, it's my opinion mm -hmm that it's both bodies' monies. And, and actually, that boils down to, it's our tribe's money. Right. That, I don't mean, I'm not calling the council our tribe. I mean, all of our tribe. Right. Well, I, I agree that it, it, it was a joint <clears throat> settlement. It was a joint venture. Our initial proposal was to try whenever they got this money from the trust board. We, we, we said exactly what he said, mm -hmm. that we should split up the money because we both was, we both, uh, was, uh, was on the lawsuit itself. Mm -hmm. It was uh, 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 the last assistant chief of the tribe who fought that tooth and nail and said, no, the tribal council gets it all. You guys don't get nothing. Well, this is a whole new council. So they, okay. So, but I, okay, council. so you need to. And you, we can have a new discussion. All Joe, said, all Joe was simply to asking to was to talk to the council members. Yeah. And um, I suggest that this be it's, it's a, a 
this be a discussion topic that will be addressed at our um, town hall meeting as well mm -hmm. for our tribal members to provide their feedback as well right and, and this should be we may need longer than four hours though and actually should be we don't have more than one good planning session good That's it actually right. should go to the people for the vote where they want what they want to do with it they want to go with the trust board they want half and half they want to Give it all to the tribal council. It's up to the people. It's the people's money. It's not ours. Actually, it belongs to individuals that was never found. And we will still be obligated to pay them people if they are ever do come ever forward. Found or they're not they're found, ever found. That, that's why that's the They're not all no. deceased. Some of them just can't be found. <laughs> if they ever come forward, the tribe will have to pay them. Well, we'll pay them. That money needs where they are. If they come forward, we'll pay them. The money needs to be put in the same place. <laughs> I agree with him, though. But it's up to the people to make up their mind. It's their money. It's not our money to make up our mind. Be mine or who? Well, yeah, 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 I, I totally agree with what they have to say. And I agree with you because, you know, we, that was our position, Chief. You know that. Council members have said that this is all our money. Yeah. No, it ain't. Right. And that's what's really the, that caused the argument. Everybody in the tribe. Yeah. Now I'm wanting it all. Now I want the trust board to have it all because because of their fight. Yeah. If they want to answer that, why don't we just get it all? So see what I did? It took it, a resolution of the tribal council. It also took a resolution from the trust board. But take the, the vote of the people. I guess. But where exactly did the the judgment come from? What? fund or trust or what where did it come from money that was returned to the office of trust fund management because they couldn't locate doctor 72 and 298 deceased that was the money that originally that, that, uh, for the land that we sold up in kansas and what does the trust document they say about that Some of them it, yeah you said that the, the, any future mm -hmm. funds or anything uh, like that pertaining to that docket the, the money right. It, it is is a governor governed by the trust, board. The, the trust board. It says that in the trust document. I have the trust document right no, here. I, know. I read it before I came uh, over. I always read it. And <laughs> Roma yeah. So yeah, I would just like to put my opinion out there that I believe that the the whole three million, you know, and I understand what you're saying that it was a combined effort. But if we're going to play by the rules, I believe the trust board should have the whole docket money. That's and like I idea. said, now if it's going to be like, then it's going to be up to the people. If there's if there's an argument like that or the disagreement or whatever, put it out to the vote of the people. What they want to do? They want to give half to the tribe, give half to the trust board. That would be one of their options. Well, I give mean, it this is this is you know opening the door for discussion as it should be. Right. There's going to be multiple opinions. You sure. know, and opinions <coughs> vary. So. That's a good idea. We'll talk about it at strategic planning, see what the people want. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Okay, is there any further new business? If not, we can set the time and date for next month's meeting. We are uh, going back to our regular meeting date, the third. We got we trust board members griping about it that we change it every month. Well, that was well, due to the last month, month, but yeah, no. it was just the last couple months because of the calendar. It's all right. The extra. So you're all right with the 19th of right. February? Is uh, everybody okay with that? Yes. As oh, far as I know, yes. Oh, let me get on the right page here. So that's, that's our normal meeting date, the third mm -hmm. Wednesday of each month. Yes, at 3 p.m. I'm going to oh, make a motion what? that our next Wait. meeting be oh, held uh, February the 19th. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What are you doing? February 13th. I'll be out of town. So, Joe, by what um, what week normally does our accounting department receive the financials in order for us to be able to report on them? <laughs> That's why they they're the one that requested it to be the third week. The third week. And if can't be here, can't be here. Yeah. I, won't, yeah. I won't be here the third Saturday of uh, 
May for the council meeting. Yeah. Okay. But I don't expect them to change it just because I'm not going to be here. Right. Yeah. And the people get used to one date. Very even, true. When you start changing it up, then we have to go hunt down Johnny and make sure he's here and recorded. <laughs> Well, I do appreciate your, your flexibility in allowing me to be here. Okay, okay Joe, you want to go ahead with your motion? Maybe by the end of the 19th. Randy, where you'd be off that day, Crystal? She's going to yes. be out of town, aren't you? Oh, yeah, you're, I'll be out of town. Oh, you'll be out of town. Yeah, I'll be out of town. So you have to wrap your vacation. We can't, if we did that, we'd be doing it for everybody on this trust board one time or another. Right. <laughs> we have before. I'm going to make the motion that our next meeting be February the 19th. At 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Instead of 3 p.m. All right. See. So that makes the ones that go to lunch here have to sit around and wait for two hours for a meeting. We can play cards. You can play cards for an hour. <laughs> <laughs> or that'll give you time to take an hour now. That's my motion, 2 p.m. <laughs> 2 o'clock. Do we have a second? I'll I'll second. second. Okay. Do we have a second? I always come in last. What date did I say? The 19th. Okay. All those in favor of the motion on the table, please say aye. 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 And, any abstentions or opposition? Okay. Meeting is set for the 19th of next month. I have a motion to adjourn. 19th of February. 2 o'clock. I may not be here either because I'm. Roger made the motion. You second. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 <coughs> Great meeting everyone. I may not be here because I'm not good at Houston, but if I 